eclipse on Monday will allow us to see the sun and the moon in a very unique way. And when the two cover each other, will you feel different somehow? Many people will feel this event in many different ways. Tonight we're consulting with a tarot card reader. Dale Ostrander is in the studio with this story right now. Dale. Michael, events like planets, like planet Mercury being in retrograde and full moons are very synonymous with the spiritual community. But when a total solar eclipse happens, it could possibly be the Super Bowl of spiritual events. Meet Jessica of Camillus. She runs Readings with Jessica, a spiritual business for 15 years. With the solar eclipse coming, she thinks your soul will be seeing more energy than it has ever seen. It is just an amplifier. Think of it as adding extra power. Think of it adding extra volts to whatever type of energy or whatever kind of power source you're trying to use. Jessica is seeing an increase in business because of the eclipse. The sun and the moon lining up have customers concerned about the spiritual side of this once in a generation event. You're going to see more energy. You're going to see people be more excited. You're going to see people just feel more grounding. She says a total solar eclipse is a rare burst of energy in the spiritual work. Because of that, people can often expect too much out of the event. Sometimes it's just let things flow. You know, listen to your intuition. Listen to what's around you. Look for signs and signals. I mean, you are your, your grounding point. Naturally, I wanted to do my first tarot card reading and see where I am spiritually before the eclipse. Oh, oh I got the devil card. That's not good. That's not good to start off with the devil. Yes, it is. It's not a problem. After starting with the devil, Jessica shockingly told me everything about myself after just meeting her. It had me concerned when it came to my future for the eclipse. Oh, uh, with solar eclipse. <laughs> well, this does not sound good. Some people are going to be a little bit more ruder around you, basically. Maybe be a little bit more aggressive. Maybe be a little bit more, you know, confrontational. Okay. So we just want to let that week go for you and just try not to get into any fights or try not oh, to get wow. into any trouble, basically. Wow. But you should be okay after that week. Well, I am definitely concerned for next week now, but Jessica also shared that the clips will be a time to come together with people spiritually, but it sounds like I need to stay absolutely away from everyone. Reporting in studio, I'm Dale Ostrander. Who has it out for you? Is it somebody outside of work or is it somebody in this building potentially? It sounds like someone I'm going to see on the solar eclipse when it happens. Mm. That's what she made it seem like. I'm a little concerned. I don't want to go outside my house I, now. I, th I think you'll be all right. You're, you're, aren't you working that day? No. No? It's all okay. good. Well, maybe right. not. Well, you'll be, you'll be plenty happy.